Hi, Scott Oak here. It's been a very physical first period. Joining me is Senator Forward Daryl Carver. Hi, Scott. Nice hair. <laughs> Thank you. Daryl, your line looked pretty good out there in the first. Yeah, it felt pretty good. You know, we gave it 110%. You know, we just took it one elbow at a time. Uh, Daryl, given the uncertain future of the centers, how are the players reacting? Well, it's hard to concentrate, you know. I mean, plus, we just received some very disturbing news. The, the team may fold? No, the team may move to Hamilton. <laughs> Daryl, I, I know it's a little hot under these lights. Oh, does it show? Uh, no. Oh. Can you pinpoint the problem of Ottawa? Is it because it's a small market team? No, no, I don't think so. I don't think so, no. Now, we got the Loblaws and the Sobeys, you know, and they're big markets. You know, Loblaws, they got that really good produce section, you know, and they got that, they rearrange the hot dogs and everything now, they're good. And you're like, I like those. I like yeah, those. What is the next step for Ronald Rod Brighton? Well, you know, he's looking for a big tax exemption, you know, by turning us in into a religious organization. You know? So from this point on, we're going to be known as the Audible Witnesses. How, how does that sit with the players? Well, you know, some of them, they're not real comfortable going door to door, you know, handing out the hot news, asking for donations and such, you know. Well, good luck to you, Daryl. I know you're looking forward to the All-Star game this weekend. Oh, yeah, you know, it's a good game, you know. Because, you know, Even though there's going to be no, like, you know, fighting, religious intention, it should be a good game. I'm really believing that. Yeah. Thanks, thanks, Daryl okay. Carter. No, don't shake, don't okay. shake. Oh, no, shake. Oh, no, shake. Oh, no, shake. Oh, no, shake.